Hi, I'm George Casey and I'm talking to you from RSM's Technology Experience Center in Denver, Colorado. One exciting way customers are taking advantage of digital transformation opportunities is through customer engagement. And one way they can do that is by leveraging social media platforms like Twitter to understand how customers are expressing their sentiment as it relates to their brand or their company. So as you see here, we have Twitter and we're looking at the, the hashtag RSM Tech Demo. And we see there have been lots of tweets about people's experience, mostly positive, but perhaps some negative. What we can do is analyze those tweets through Power BI in a Power BI dashboard to kind of drill in and understand where are they coming from, when are they coming in, and what's their general sentiment. So if I were to look at one specific tweet, it says, I love KC, very positive sentiment, almost 1.0. Clicking to the next tweet in the list, I don't like Mondays, a negative sentiment expressed. But by understanding this in the context of our brand, we can then understand what's the best next action. And what we're going to show next is how we use Microsoft Flow to both read in these tweets from Twitter, move, run them through Microsoft Cognitive Services so that we can apply some text analytics and understand is this sentiment positive or is it negative, and then assign the next step, whether we need to create a case in Microsoft Dynamics 365 for customer engagement so we can have our customer service team follow up, or we're going to add it to Teams and share some of the positive sentiment with other product managers that we have at the company. So here we see our flow by which we evaluate that when a new tweet is posted, we're going to detect the sentiment that using Microsoft Cognitive Services and text analytics. Based on the outcome or the assessed sentiment, whether it's positive or negative, we're then going to insert a row in the database. Now, if it's seen as a negative tweet, we're going to send an email to a product manager, as well as create a new record in Dynamics 365 for customer engagement identifying a follow-up action for that customer service team. If it's positive, we're going to send a message in Teams so that other product and brand managers understand this is the real-time sentiment being assessed by the customers. Now, if we switch to Dynamics, we can see an example of here's that case from Social Listening where we had a tweet text that said, I wanted to check out the Technology Experience Center, but I couldn't make it to Denver, so now I hate you all. This was assessed as negative. We have a follow-up step to follow up with this customer, perhaps schedule another visit. But this shows kind of very quickly how we can take advantage of the Microsoft framework, as well as common public data sources like Twitter, to better connect uh, with our customers.